you know, I know I'm probably going to cause a debate for saying this, but I personally think that Tomori is the best English center back in the world right now. Yep, I said it. Tomori, hands down, best English center back in the world, you know. Especially you look at his recent performances with AC Milan. He's been really consistent for him, and he's been playing as good as prime Sergio Ramos, in my honest opinion, you know. So I'm just trying to figure out why the hell did Gareth Southgate not select him for the 2022 World Cup with England? Why was he left out of England's World Cup squad? And this is where I think Gareth Southgate kind of screwed up with his World World Cup selections, if I'm being honest here, because it's like, you mean to tell me that he's going to select players like Harry Maguire over players like Tamori? Like, why? That's what I'm trying to figure out, because if there's one player that I think should not be selected for England's World Cup squad, I think it would have to be Harry Maguire, if I'm being honest here, because, you know, uh, Tamori, he's obviously a way better center back than Harry Maguire is, and you guys can look this up, because according to Stadza, uh, John, well, John Stones, <laughs> Tomori, he made the most successful challenges and I guess what, uh, tackles out of any other English center back. And you mean to tell me that Gareth Southgate wasn't going to, that, that you mean to tell me that Gareth Southgate didn't select him for England's squad at the 2022 World Cup? Like, I just think that Gareth Southgate completely made the biggest mistake, especially by selecting players like, you know, uh, John Stones and Maguire ahead of, you know, um, now, John Stones, I think he's personally decent to be a defender. I think John Stones is a decent defender. But the fact that Gareth Southgate selected them over Tamori just doesn't make any sense to me. And that's what I really am trying to figure out right now with Gareth Southgate's World Cup selection. Because, you know, uh, England, they could have used Tamori. Like, say that England struggled defensively at the World Cup. I think that, you know... Um, that's going to give you a clear indication of why Gareth Southgate should have selected Tomori. Because, you know, you look at Tomori, man, he is an absolutely talented center back, especially for AC Milan. Like, he's a leader on the pitch. And I think that Tomori is, without a doubt, uh, way better than players like John Stones, Harry Maguire. Like, he is definitely, I think, miles ahead of them in terms of, you know, quality for English center backs. And just the fact that Gareth Southgate just still, in his eyes, didn't... And the fact that even, even despite Tomori's performances in the Serie A as an English center back was really good and just absolutely incredible. And, accor and according to Gareth Southgate's eyes, you know, in his eyes, I... I guess he still thinks like that's not good enough or something. Like, I don't know what Gareth Salke was thinking, but the fact that Tomori was left out of England's World Cup squad is absolutely disgraceful and just one of the dumbest decisions that Gareth Southgate could have ever possibly made if you want to know my honest opinion because you know with Tomori right now he's becoming I feel like slowly but surely he's becoming a leader at AC Milan much like how you know Sergio Ramos became a leader in defense for Real Madrid in his prime like I feel like that Tomori's performances are really up there with Ramos performances with Real Madrid that it would make sense for somebody like uh, Tamori to be selected ahead of, you know, the likes of John Stones and Harry Maguire, but I guess in Gareth Southgate's eyes, that's still not good enough. Like, I don't know what Gareth Southgate's thinking, man, but I just think that this is where Gareth Southgate's World Cup selections will come back and bite him back because, you know, uh, with Tamori, man, like, he has all the traits and the quality to be a leader in, you know, in England's defense. Like, come on, dude, you mean to tell me that Tamori doesn't have the quality and the traits to be a leader in England's defense? Like, come on, bro, that's bullshit. Like, he should have been selected that Gareth Southgate, you know, I think took a real fat L of not selecting him for the World Cup. That it makes you realize that by him selecting Maguire and Johnstones ahead of ahead of a uh, Tomori just goes to show you here how really uh, stupid Gareth Southgate's decision making can sometimes really be. I mean, seriously, like. You mean to tell me that Harry Maguire, a defender who has been very inconsistent for United this season, was selected ahead of Tamori? Like, that's freaking stupid. I'm sorry, but what the heck?